Hey, what's up there, YouTube friends? It's Grumpy Gamer Dad here. My wife has amassed quite a large collection of Minnie Mouse ears, and um, we are going to, well, decorate the walls with them. Yeah, we just painted these walls, but now we're going to put a bunch of holes in them so we can put these ears up. It's better than them just sitting in a box, I guess. So she found these on Etsy. Uh, they're perfect for hanging the ears. There's a single hole there. Uh, we're going to try and use this large furniture tack to uh, get them to stick into the wall and then put the ears on. Uh, these look like they were 3D printed. Um, so I, we've never used them before and hopefully they're pretty good. Like any great artist, we have a blank canvas. <laughs> For the thicker ears, like these light up type ears, um, these little hooks will not work because the battery pack takes up too much space. There's not a good uh, bond there. But what we did was we got some of these like little uh, 3M mounting squares, put those on the, the uh, hook, and then the ears will attach just to that. There's no chance of them slipping down, uh, although I would recommend you mount them onto the wall before you stick them because there's no way to get to that tack pole and there's the end result and there we go there is the finished wall using those little hook to hang your ears on uh, the good thing about them is you can take the the ears easily off the hook those that are now depending on how big of a collector you are you're either thinking grumpy that's a lot of ears or you're thinking that's not that many. What are you making such a big deal about for? Well, this is just the collection that's going to my wife's home office. You know, we all have home offices now, thanks to COVID, right? But we've had many ears on display before this. I'm at the top of my stairs, and if you look down, you'll see those shadow boxes are all ears. So we got this idea a few years ago, um, putting one set of ears in a shadow box. So from the top of the stairs down, we've got the rose gold ears that everybody went crazy over. We've got pirate mini ears. You've got Elsa frozen mini ears. We have Mardi Gras mini mouse ears. And then you've got just plain old run of the mill OG mini mouse polka dot ears. Now I have to be honest over the last few weeks my wife's got a little ear crazy and has bought a number of ears and I just wanted to showcase those few ears specifically. These are from Loungefly. These are special Nightmare Before Christmas ears uh, featuring different characters from the Nightmare Before Christmas. You got this sequin middle bow there. So the first pair of ears is the Nightmare Before Christmas. It's got all those creepy crawlies from that movie. You got Scarecrow Jack and Sally. Here we've got a Zero the Ghost Dog. These are very cool. They just came out in the last uh, couple weeks actually. Also from the Ink and Paint series, you've got this set here featuring some animated characters in the background there uh, and then crossed paint brushes. Much like the Ink and Paint key, you've got different characters. We've got Dumbo here, Mr. Toad, Pinocchio, White Rabbit, Sorcerer Mickey. You've got these crossed paint brushes and on the back you've got that paint palette with little Mickey designs of paint. And finally one of her new acquisitions is this from the new attraction, hopefully, coming to Disneyland in the next few years. If it opens, it's this from Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway Ride. This pair of ears is from the Mickey and Minnie Runaway Railway. This is weird. You've got this like inflated plastic bubble. The side of the band says nothing can stop us now. And the opposite side just has this railway pattern. The coolest feature though is this uh, bobblehead type foam train. Uh, it's not the camera shaking, it's the bobblehead. Yeah, it's on a spring here. Well, there you go. I guess that's my first official ear video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, at Grumpy Gamer Dad. Until next time, this is Grumpy Gamer Dad saying, without ears, you can't hear it.